channel how are you guys doing i hope you're doing amazing sending positive vibes like always so today i'm so excited because 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 i finally have another makeup look i am going to be showing you what i bought from the collection and i am so excited i will be showing you how to do this makeup look which i am obsessed with i use a couple of colors maybe you're not able to tell um, right now but as you see the tutorial part you will see what colors I used obviously I wasn't able to use every single color but don't you worry I do have more makeup looks coming up a little bit more easier makeup looks where you don't have to use falsies because let's be honest not everybody uses falsies every single day not everybody likes falsies so I want to be able to upload makeup looks for you guys that do not require falsies also I will be doing more colorful looks and i'm just super excited to get more videos up for you guys so without further ado let's get into the video before i get into this gorgeous makeup look and showing you guys what i bought from the collection and telling you guys what i think about it i do want to let you guys know that i will leave you timestamps just in case if you're interested in the unboxing part or the tutorial part or my final thoughts or if you want to watch the whole video thank you so much i do appreciate it and also something very very important i will be uploading more videos for you guys yes 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 i hope you guys are excited um my new schedule is wednesdays and fridays at 1 p.m and every other sunday so my idea is for sunday to be more relaxed i might go live with you guys i might do a little podcast you never know it's gonna be a surprise kind of so I really hope that you guys enjoy it. I do want to be able to get up more content for you guys, whether it's a haul, a review, a makeup look, more vlogs, or I want to start incorporating more people into my videos. Um, I just want to bring you guys more variety. And if you have any suggestion, if you want to see more videos from me, please let me know in the comments down below. Or if you don't like to leave comments, feel free to DM me on Instagram. I love talking to you guys. I love being able to know who watches me because it honestly means a lot. I will never stop thanking you guys, okay? So now, let's get on with the video. So let's start off with a little mini unboxing. This is actually the box it came in. And as you can see, everything is very well packaged. I love how Beauty Creation packages everything. I love the tissue paper she made. Everything in this collection, every single little detail is 10 out of 10. Let me show you exactly what I got. So I'm going to start off with this kit. It is a lip kit called the True Red Kit. There's two different ones. This is the red one. I absolutely love red, so I had to purchase this one. It does retail for $12, and look at the beautiful packaging. Doesn't this scream luxury to you for $12? I think that price point is amazing. And every single little detail she put in this collection, I honestly am obsessed. If you guys don't know, she dedicated this lip kit to her mom. And I think that's so beautiful. That little touch to my heart when she said that she dedicated this to her mom. I will be swatching these in a second so you can see how amazing the pigment is. Next, we do have this palette. You guys, when I saw this palette for the first time, when I saw that she swatched the colors, when I saw all of the colors in general i was so impressed i wanted that palette as soon as i saw it i think it's a stunning palette it has so many colors it has so many finishes so many tones i think it's a beautiful palette if you're barely starting into makeup this is beautiful because you have different finishes different colors there's so much to do with this palette and especially these colors right here they swatched so beautiful i cannot wait to do tutorials obviously i'm gonna do one in a second but i will be doing a lot of tutorials because this palette is stunning for 27 dollars, i think you can't go wrong even if you're a pro at makeup this is a beautiful palette to add to your collection you have now entered the tutorial part so i am taking this base from beauty creations and applying it all over my eye making sure everything is very well blended starting off with the color transition i'm going to pack this 
on my lid specifically on my crease and a little bit above my crease i am making sure to tap in the product to make sure the color is very present next taking a big blending brush and dipping into the color 5m i'm going to be placing this in tapping motions a bit above the color i just applied going back in with the color 5m and hello i'm going to mix those two on my brush and I'm going to start blending the borders out to make sure everything looks seamless and very well blended. Next, I'm going to take the color Hello on a packing brush and I'm going to place this under my eyebrow. Going in with Transition and Tamaulipas on the same brush, I'm going to apply this color on my actual crease in tapping motions. Now I'm going to go back to every shade that I use and make sure that I add one more layer from the first tone that I use to the last. This is going to assure me that every single color is present and that everything is very well blended. Now it's time to cut the crease. I am using the base and a very thin brush and I am making sure that I am cutting above my natural crease. I like to do this because this assures me that every single shadow that I have all over my eye, including on my eyelid, is very present. Don't forget to remove all the excess base off your lid. I'm going to dip into Diego using my finger and look at this swatch. Isn't that impressive? 10 out of 10 with this shade. I'm going to apply this on top of the base that I just applied a couple of seconds ago. And to make sure that I am getting all the base coated, I'm taking a small brush and some MAC Fix Plus and tapping in the shadow. Taking the shades Transition and Tamaulipas, I'm going to apply this on my outer corner and I'm going to make sure to blend it in with the Diego tone. Moving on to the lower lash line, I'm going to take the color Red Wine and I'm going to start applying this on my lower lash line in tapping motions. Going in with Red Wine and Dulcito, I'm going to add these for a further blend. And I'm going to start pushing these two colors out to mimic a wing. Adding a brown in the waterline and setting it with the tone Inspiración. This is going to assure me that the color does not move throughout the whole day. To clean up a little bit under my eyes, I'm going to take some concealer and this thin brush and I'm going to start cleaning it up a little bit. This is going to make my eye look a little bit more lifted and it's going to give me a wing effect without me actually having to do a wing. Taking the shades Foco and Chico's, I'm going to apply this in my inner corner. Time for some mascara and the falsies. And this is the makeup completed. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. I really hope that you were able to follow along. I really hope that this was easy for you guys. I know this is not super easy if you are a beginner, but it isn't too, too hard. So I hope that you enjoyed it. I absolutely love how it came out. I love the color combos. I try to use a lot of colors that are in the palette. Obviously, there's so many ways that you can use this palette. Like I said, I will be doing more tutorials, something a little bit more advanced, something with just mascara for the people that don't wear lashes. Because to be honest with you guys, I don't wear lashes every single day. I personally love my own lashes and there are ways that you can make eyeshadow look really pretty with just mascara. So I do want to give you guys my lip combo just in case if anybody is interested. So I did go ahead and I used this. So this is what I use on my eyes. Obviously, I wiped it off with alcohol and I went ahead and I used it. It is from the brand Nabi. I got these from Amazon. I will leave them linked below because these are so good. I do plan on doing a... Um, um, oh, I lost my train of thought. I do plan on doing a video for you guys to show you every single color that comes in this pack and swatching them because these are so good. I honestly think they are way better than Morphe and they are so, so cheap. So this color is black brown. And I will go ahead and I will swatch it for you guys so you guys can see. So I put that um, all over my lips. I, 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 
I outlined, oh my god, and then I like smudged it with my finger and then I went ahead and I used this. So this is from the collab from Lee Torres X Beauty Creations and this is the color Keep It Classy. I absolutely love this color. Absa, absa, absolutely love it. I use it so much. I can't get enough of this color. It's so beautiful by itself. It's so beautiful with something else. Stunning, stunning color. And then on top, because I wanted something a little bit glossy, I put the Murillo Twins um, lip gloss, which I am almost out of. This one has to be my favorite. And I will show you guys. So you guys can see what each one looks like by themselves. This is the color I was actually using when I started off the video because I always have to have something on my lips. It doesn't matter if it's glossy or not, even if it's just a chapstick. I always like to have something on my lips. So I combined those three and it gave me this. And I absolutely love how it turned out. Um, obviously you could go lighter if you want to and if you want to go like more darker you can. It all depends on you. And if there's something that you want to rock and you don't feel comfortable doing it, I say just do it. You only live once. So if you like it, that's all that matters. So I do want to give you guys my final thoughts on this whole collection. I know I didn't do a makeup look using the red lippy, but don't you worry. I will do another look using that red lipstick because it is so stunning. I have to do a lip. I have to do a look with that lip. But coming back to this, this palette, 10 out of 10 guys, just the few colors that I used. These babies are pigmented house down boots. These are so beautiful. Um, I can't wait to do other looks. I have to do a look with this blue. I have to do a look using these like more. I have to do a look using this green. <sighs> There's so many ways you can use this palette. And as you saw, I used a couple shades and I really like how this turned out. This is more of a dramatic look, I know. But I'm going to do easier looks and a little bit more harder looks, you can say. So the palette is a 10 out of 10. I have nothing bad to say. I absolutely love it. If you guys want to see me swatch the whole palette, just a video of me swatching the whole palette, let me know because I can get that up for you guys as soon as possible. Um, just let me know if you want that. I don't mind doing that. So that is it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you that watches my videos, that comments, that likes, and all that jazzy stuff. So if you're not subscribed, don't forget to do so and hit the little bell so you can get notified every single time I post a new video. I will see you in my next one. Bye.